What's up Mustang fans? Today is Monday, January 16th, and tomorrow we're expecting a press conference from Ford where they will detail the newly refreshed 2018 Mustang. Now thanks to our friends over at Mustang 6G, we got our first peek at the car a little bit early. Some leaked photos and videos of the car surfaced tonight, and so I'm gonna give you my first impressions of the car now, and tomorrow we're gonna discuss some of the more specific aspects after the press conference. The most noticeable change to the car comes to the front fascia. The headlights have been redesigned in what to me looks like a mix between the S197 headlights on the 2011 to 2014 Mustang and the S550 headlights found on the 2015 and up Mustang. It also looks like the hood is a bit lower on the refreshed car, maybe to improve visibility over the already long hood and make the car feel a little bit lower to the ground. Out back, the taillight design has changed slightly to pay homage to the 50th anniversary of the 1968 model and its curved rear taillights. There are also a set of new quad exhaust pipes out back. I bet this is for an active exhaust feature. A new spoiler is seen with the GT Performance Package. It seems to draw some inspiration from the GT350R spoiler, but it's a bit more modest than the one found on the Shelby. Now I will admit when I first opened up the form and I saw the pictures of the 2018 refresh, I did think that the car looked a little bit awkward. But to be fair, I actually wasn't so impressed with the 2015 Mustang either when it first came out, but that design has grown on me a lot. And even tonight, just looking at this car a couple of times on the internet, the design is actually growing on me a lot. I really like how they got rid of the pointy tips of the taillights on the 2015, which was actually my least favorite aspect of the front end on the 2015 model. I think that the new headlights are gonna give it a little bit more of an aggressive look, and I think I can appreciate where Ford was going with this. So let me know in the comments your first impressions on the 2018 Mustang refresh, and I'll see you guys tomorrow with more specific information.